I have stepped out upon this platform that I may see you and that you may see me, and in the arrangement I have the best of the bargain. The demon of intemperance ever seems to have delighted in sucking the blood of genius and of generosity. As I would not be a slave, so I would not be a master. This expresses my idea of democracy. The one victory we can ever call complete will be that one which proclaims that there is not one slave or one drunkard on the face of God's green earth. All I ask for the Negro is that if you do not like him, let him alone. If God gave him but little, that little let him enjoy. I leave you, hoping that the lamp of liberty will burn in your bosoms until there shall no longer be a doubt that all men are created free and equal. No man is good enough to govern another man, without that other's consent. I say this is the leading principle the sheet anchor of American republicanism. In regard to this great book, I have but to say, it is the best gift God has given to man. All the good the Savior gave to the world was communicated through this book. Let us have faith that right makes might, and in that faith, let us, to the end, dare to do our duty as we understand it. Public sentiment is everything. With public sentiment, nothing can fail, without it nothing can succeed. If we have no friends, we have no pleasure, and if we have them, we are sure to lose them, and be doubly pained by the loss. I distrust the wisdom if not the sincerity of friends who would hold my hands while my enemies stab me. I'm a success today because I had a friend who believed in me and I didn't have the heart to let him down. I do the very best I know how the very best I can, and I mean to keep on doing so until the end. My great concern is not whether you have failed, but whether you are content with your failure. Give me six hours to chop down a tree and I will spend the first four sharpening the axe. I am in favor of animal rights as well as human rights. That is the way of a whole human being. If you are resolutely determined to make a lawyer of yourself, the thing is more than half done already. The greatest fine art of the future will be the making of a comfortable living from a small piece of land. I have never had a feeling politically that did not spring from the sentiments embodied in the Declaration of Independence.